Shekinah Worship Center announcements for this week. Theme for 2018, Kingdom Dynamics, Matthew 9, 37, 38. Then saith he unto his disciples, The harvest truly is plenteous, but the laborers are few. Pray ye therefore the Lord of the harvest, that he will send forth laborers into his harvest. Visitors, thanks for being with us today. Join us in the seats you room for further fellowship after service. Our buy a brick box is located in the entrance. Please give as you can. Every bit helps. Our Super Tuesday prayer that a spirit of true repentance will usher in a flow of salvation upon the island of Bermuda. Wednesday, Pastor Seaman will teach on feet washing. Friday, this is Good Friday, 9 a.m. to noon. A blessing awaits you. Good Friday, 2018. Friday, March 30th, 2018. 9 a.m. to noon at Shekinah Worship Center. You are welcome to join us for a life-impacting session of God's Word. This year, the seven last scenes. Theme, It Is Finished. The first word, Superintendent Janice Battersby, it is finished. The betrayal is finished. Luke 23, 34. The second word, Deaconess Lene Richardson. It is finished. The battle of flesh is finished. Luke 23, 43. The third word, Alda Esther Trot. It is finished. The bloodline is finished. John 19, 26, 27. The fourth word, Elder Marion James. It is finished. The bond is finished. Matthew 27, 46, 47, and Mark 15, 34. The fifth word, Elder Vincent Otterbridge. It is finished. The body is finished. John 15, 12, 13. The sixth word, Alda Sharon Haywood. It is finished. The brokerage is finished. John 19, 30. The seventh word, Pastor Maria Seaman. It is finished. The bridge is finished. Luke 23, 46. Come and experience a delicious time in the Word of God as never before. You won't regret your time with us. So join us this Good Friday, Friday, March 30th, 9 to noon. You don't want to miss this. And you know what I'm saying. Blessings abound. Saturday, Band and Praise Team Rehearsal, 12.30 p.m. A Bible Mega Moment, what is this saying? Answer, be strong and courageous. If you would like to purchase a CD or DVD, please place your order at the media table. Sermons available include survival skills. First things first, the Pascal Lamb. Should we go and fight the enemy? The priests would then take the message to God and God will show up as light and he begin to light up on the um and and thumman, and that will give the answer. When the light showed up, it means go forward. When the light shows up, it means I've given you victory. When the light shows up, it means you shall recover all. Oh. ain't is not about how you feel. Jira is not about, well, I'm singing because I can. No, that's, that's Moab. And we got to make sure, I hope my musicians are going to get this. We got to make sure that our Judah is a true Judah praise. And, and not because we just want to feel good. And we want to make you feel good. No, it ain't about feeling. It's about faith. Take me to Judah. Don't drop me off at Moab. Take me to Judah. Don't drop me off at Moab. Church. Without going into greater detail, I want you to see the setup. 
God sent a ram, male sheep. God said he will provide himself a lamb in the future. God's children got in bondage in a place that worshipped what they raised and ate. That was a total abomination to the Egyptians. The two sides were set against each other. It was never going to work out with your enemy. Happy birthday, Sister Carolyn Lamb, March 27th. Please look in our church bulletin for all church invites and other important information. Pastor Seema will be guest speaker on Sunday, April 22nd at 4.30 p.m. at First Church of God, Angle Street with Pastors Haywood and B. The sports scene. Congratulations, Niaja White. Mentioned in the newspaper, two West Pembroke students dominated the Overton girls division, one of which was our own Niaja White, first in 200, second in 100, and third in 400. This past Friday night, Niaja also scored a midfield goal at the Kappa tournament. Check out Niaja's first place run. of encouragement for the week. Beauty catches the attention, but character catches the heart. Making mistakes is better than faking perfections. Courage doesn't always roar. Sometimes courage is the quiet voice at the end of the day. He's saying, I will try again tomorrow. When writing the story of your life, don't let anyone else hold the pen. Swim family, these are announcements for the week. Please govern yourselves accordingly, and you know what I'm saying. Blessings abound.